Yes, it finished 3-3 in the final game in name in DC Park. Uh, Longford uh, had the better of the first half by far. They came out well quicker than Galway in the first half. Galway had a very poor start to the game. Uh, Darren Clark in the ninth minute got the fir- opening goal. He was causing mayhem d- down Galway's right hand side for the whole game. Adam Thomas just couldn't deal with him. Uh, Evan O'Connor got his first goal for Galway United on the 27th minute from a set piece. He rose above the defender and headed it nicely home to get Galway back on level terms against the run of play, you'd have to say. Uh, after this, Matthew O'Brien got a goal in the 35th minute for Longford. A uh, good bit of play, but he uh, initially, Connor Kearns done a great save, but the ball fell to Matthew O'Brien in the box and he just tapped it home to make it 2 1. And Christian Magerson got a goal from a header in the 85th or the 45th minute and five minutes added on into the first half. Uh, a deflected corner going into the back of the net. Galway came out very quickly in the second half. Rob Manley in the 46th minute got a goal after a brilliant ball found him in the area and he tapped it home. And Galway uh, very well in the second half. They were dominating the second half. Uh, They created the most chances. Longford seemed to want to defend what they had, whereas Galway kind of just went all in, nothing to lose at this point. And they played very well. Rob Manley got his second goal of the night in the 81st minute after a brilliant ball from Evan O'Connor found in the box as he headed it. It seemed to come off the crossbar and hit him again and then go back into the net, but it was a brilliant ball and brilliant spatial awareness from Rob Manley to get in there and put his body on the line to get the equalising goal for Galway. So finished 3-3 on the night and Galway will be facing Longford in the playoffs in the coming weeks.